All right, my brilliant mathematicians, we got this question. Which equation is not equivalent to the other three? So one of these four is not the same as the other three. Three of them should match up, one is different. Well, the problem is this is written in point slope form. This is written in slope intercept form, standard form, and standard form. So they're all written differently. That's why they don't appear to look the same right now. But if we can put them all into the same form, then we should be able to see if they match up. For example, if I take this equation here, which is in point slope form, and I convert it to y equals, isolate the y so that I have it in slope intercept form, if this comes out to 3x plus 10, we'll know that these match. So let's start there. We're just gonna rearrange the ones that we want to. I always like to go in slope intercept form. It seems to be one of the easiest ones to convert to. So here we go, three times x, three times one, we need to distribute. That's gonna give me three x plus three, because three times one makes three. And then we need to use inverse operations by adding seven. That would cancel out that term on the left side, add seven to the right side, and by golly, we end up with three x plus 10. Notice that we have a match. A and B are the same. So I'm imagining B or D, one of these two is not gonna be the same as the other three. Let's go over to B. Uh, we got standard form right here, that's X and Y terms on the left side with a constant on the right. Our job is to get Y alone on the left side, so isolate Y. All right, we're gonna do that by saying minus 3X cancels minus 3X. These are not like terms, so they do not go together. You just keep them separated as two different terms. Bring 7Y down, divide by 7, divide by 7, divide by 7, you get negative 3 sevenths x plus 4 sevenths. This is in slope intercept form, but it looks nothing like these two that are also in slope intercept form. So that tells me our answer is probably B, but I'm gonna check D just in case to make sure. Okay, same thing, it's in standard form. X and Y terms are on the left side. Let's isolate Y so that we can put it in slope intercept form and hopefully this one comes out to 3x plus 10. Add 15x, add 15x, 5y equals 15x plus 50, divide by five, divide by five. 15 divided by five gives you that 3x, 50 divided by five gives you that 10 that we are looking for and these all match. B is the one that is not equivalent to the rest. So, you got them all written out in different forms? Convert them. Put them all into the same form. Check after you've done that. Study hard and good luck on your upcoming test.